Smash Beer Review and today is the Spiral Label. Um, 9X1 HKP ZDU XX4. Uh, this is Challenger Hops with Munich Malt and Sapphire SO4. 4.5% ABV, brewed 22nd of April 17 and it's a best bitter. Feels reasonably firm, not too firm. I have seen one of these go as a gusher so far, so I'm prepared for that. Ah, she's going. Ah, just caught. Now, it's been in the fridge since yesterday. I'd already cold crashed the whole case for two days. So, I think it's safe to assume it's possibly overprimed. Um, I know that the review I've seen that yeah, there was no mention of uh, possible infection so I can only assume then it was just over primed um, I've seen another bear that looks the same in that regard right what do we got other than the fact it's very hazy it looks like a best bitter nice dark tan um, almost tending to uh, a light ruby not fully um, nice compact head small white just off white creamy bubbles good carbonation I don't know if you can see that I can see it there's plenty of carbonation going on inside I mean you saw the paw was heavily carbonated so aroma I don't expect much. Ooh, a little bit. Challenger. That's a little lightness there. Right. Going for the test. Yeah, um, I can test the Challenger hops. Very, uh, almost slightly light and mint. But nice. Yeah, a yeah, reasonable mouthfeel. Right, I don't think I've used much Munich malt myself. So I've not done a, a big beer with it. I, I get the fact there's a little watery on the end. It doesn't stay. That mouth, initial mouthfeel doesn't stay with it. It's a, it's a nice beer. Um, a best bitter. And a nice best bit of the I, wear, I like the way the Challenger kind of lifts it above being a, a dark, heavyish kind of beer. It does lighten it a, a fraction. Um, the Munich it is a nice mold. It's almost slightly roasty, is that? Only very slight. Um, nice. A nice solid beer. Thank you very much. 9x1 HKP. If I can uh, just use part of your name. Thanks a lot. Another lovely beer.